So how do we go about taking these corrected um, x, y's and putting them back into the seismic data? So we're going to, um, sorry, go back to Kingdom here. Sorry, I've just opened it up again. Um, go Survey, Seismic Direct. And so in Seismic Direct, we can actually copy and paste the corrected coordinates. Just wait for it to open. I possibly need a new computer. <laughs> I suppose I'm doing a lot of things at once. Okay, so here's back in Seismic Direct. We keep the folders we had. We click on Explore. Okay, and the file that we altered was this Migrate one. So I'm going to go into this Migrate folder, click on the actual SIGWA file, and then click here on Export. Okay, I'm going to just maximize it. Okay, and I'm going to display CDP and Source X and Source Y, because that was what we originally copied. Receive, we said receive X and receive Y was also the same. Mm. Okay, and so what I'm literally going to do is go from GSOP and copy and paste it into here. Um, that's a GSOFT reminder to save. So I'm going to go back here into GSOFT. I'm going to triple check that there's no extra s cells at the bottom and at the top. Um, because that just causes trouble. Okay, I'm going to highlight and go copy, and I'm going to go back to size with direct, and I'm going here and I'm going to paste it. And you can see it's changed it to a negative, so at least we know the pasting has worked. And I'm going to go here as well and copy, and I'm going to paste it. Now, I'll tell you something else once it's done, but let's let's just export it. Okay, export. It should give us an option to rename it so that we don't write over the data. Okay. So, I'm going to take that one, and I'm going to add to the end here fixed coordinates. And SE, SE is my initials save it. Okay, so now what I want to go do is load it into Kingdom Suite and compare it with this new data. But please note that I've now added a negative. So wherever I plot this in Kingdom is not going to plot where the original line plotted. So I'm actually going to go into King, uh, GeoSoft here and let's just see. I want to go back to the original coordinates I had before I started changing them. So these were the coordinates, you can see it's not the fixed database, these were the coordinates I had just at the beginning. I copied them and then I converted them to be negative. So I'm literally, I want to copy these and create another segue that I can compare with my fixed segue. So I'm going to make sure I'm at the top, click here, paste, and click here, and copy, and Paste. So we haven't really seen a difference because a lot of the gaps were further down. I'm going to click on export and I'm, I'm not going to add the word fixed because these aren't fixed. I'm just going to click on this original one and say neg coordinates. So I know that the, these are the, the coordinates of the negatives in them. Okay, and it's exported. So let's go and see if this works. <coughs> 